This is Chris Bidai. You also like, subscribe. Subscribe to TNW Wrestling on YouTube. Subscribe to my other channel, Word of Chris. And subscribe to this channel, Chris Bidai. You also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and both of my TikToks. It will be down there in the description box. And I am here to do my WWE Friday Night Smackdown December 30th, 2022 reviews. So here we go discussing about Friday Night Smackdown. Now this is the last Smackdown of 2022. And yeah, let's go ahead and start breaking it down. So we start off with the first segment of the night. It was Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt makes his way down to the ring. And he starts talking, talking about how he is Bray Wyatt. And he still can't believe it. You know, he's still showing his feelings to the fans and all that stuff. You know, stuff like that. But then he starts talking about how uh, he wants to apologize to that cameraman from last week that he attacked. He said, you know, he... He didn't have nothing to do with what's been going on and all that. So he wants to say he's sorry about what he did last week. But then while he was talking about the cameraman, Bray Wyatt gets interrupted by L.A. Knight. L.A. Knight comes down. He goes like, look, what you did to the cameraman was terrible, but I don't care, okay? I want to get down to business and talk about me and you because even the that Uncle Howdy guy came out a few weeks ago showing that it's not you, you still got some something to do with all this. So he gets in the ring with Bray Wyatt, he gets face to face with Bray Wyatt, and pretty much he starts challenging Bray Wyatt into a match at the Warrior Rumble. Um uh, and um uh, Bray Wyatt pretty much accepts he accepts the challenge at the Warrior Rumble he calls LA Knight idiot and all that stuff. Tell him he don't got nothing to do with what's been going on. Like he's always been telling him and all that stuff. And yeah, that's what Barry Wyatt was saying. But then all of a sudden, they get interrupted by Uncle Howdy. Uncle Howdy walks all the way down to the ring. He gets in the ring. He gets in between L.A. Knight and Bray Wyatt. He looks at Bray Wyatt, staring him down like he's going to do something. But then he steps right beside Bray Wyatt. Um, looks like he's on Bray Wyatt's side. And looks like they're about to attack L.A. Knight. Up until Uncle Howdy hits Sister Abigail onto Bray Wyatt, laying him out. So yeah, Uncle Howdy attacked Bray Wyatt tonight on SmackDown, laying him out with Sister Abigail. L.A. Knight got out the ring. He goes like, what's going on and all that stuff. And Uncle Howdy leaves out the ring. So yeah, that's what happened. Uncle Howdy attacks and lays out Bray Wyatt tonight on SmackDown. That's what happened. Man, it was a pretty good uh, segment. So yeah, at the Royal Rumble, it looks like it's going to be a one-on-one -on -one match between Bray Wyatt and L.A. Knight. Now this is going to be Bray Wyatt's uh, maybe first televised match. Now, he already had his first match against Jinder Mahal, and if you guys notice, he already suffered an injury with uh, a broken finger. If you can see it where it's, like, taped up when he was holding the mic and stuff. So, yeah, he's injured right now, but, you know, a broken finger, he shouldn't be all that long, you know? So, yeah, uh, first televised match, it looks like it'll be up against LA Knight at the Warrior Rumble. So yeah, that's what happened there. And then we get to another segment where we see Sami Zayn walking backstage and he goes up to Roman Reigns' locker room. He knocks on the door. Paul Heyman comes out. And uh, he says, what do you want, Sami? And Sami was like, uh, I want to talk some strategy with Roman and all that stuff about the tag team match. And Paul Heyman starts talking to him, talking about how Roman has been happy about uh, Sami Zayn's loyalty to the bloodline and all that stuff. And... Um, he don't want to like talk right now or whatever, but he's happy about what Sami Zayn said about Kevin Owens and John Cena last week on SmackDown and all that stuff. So yeah, that's what Paul Heyman was saying. Then he looks at Sami Zayn. He goes like, "I was just messing around. You can go in the locker room and uh, talk strategy with Romans uh, for tonight's match." And Sami Zayn walks in the locker room. So yeah. Uh, later on tonight in the main event, it will be Sami Zayn and Roman Reigns versus John Cena and Kevin Owens in a tag team match in the main event for tonight's Friday Night SmackDown. And not only that, later on tonight, we will see Ronda Rousey defending the SmackDown Women's Championship up against Raquel Rodriguez, one-on-one later on tonight for the title. But up next, it will be the first match of the night. It will be Sheamus versus Solo Sokoa. 101 up next on SmackDown. So yeah, that match will be happening up next. But yeah, I'll see you guys later until the next thing that happens on Friday Night SmackDown. See you guys later until then.